So there's a couple of websites I want to talk about that will help uh, satisfactory planning in a major, major way. The first one is the Satisfactory Wiki. Um, for what we're going to talk about today, I just want to look up the production amounts of the things that I'm mining. So let's say I'm mining iron ore. And there's this little table here. If you have an impure node, a normal node, or a pure node, or a Mark 1, Mark 2, Mark 3 um, miner. So let's say I've got a Mark 3 miner on a normal node. That means I'm producing 240 iron ore per minute. So now I can go into my satisfactory-calculator.com. This is the front page. And you can go to Planners, Production Planner. And I want to make screws. So the first thing I do is I go to my input section and I add an item and I'm adding iron ore. I can, I have 200, whoops, 240 iron ore a minute. Let's say I want to make screws. So I'm going to make mm, screws. And to make one screw a minute, it will take a quarter of an iron ore per minute. So let's see what happens. I want to maximize. I want to use this entire iron ore thing to make screws. So I'm going to try to get this number here up to 240. So I'm using all of it. So let's say I want to make 500 screws a minute. And then it refreshes. And that will only take 125 iron ore. Okay. So let's make uh, 1,200. Oh, nope. See what happens is it pops up. Here's my 240 iron ore in, and it says, nope, you're going to need more. You're going to need another miner to get another 200, another 60 a minute. So we're going to have to lower it. So we'll say, uh, what does 1,100 mean? Nope, I still need more. So I, I only want to use this one node. So if I use 1,000, oh, I'm only 10 units over. So let's try 950. 950 screws a minute is the output. The input is 237 and a half out of 240. Let's just bump that up to 955. 960. There we go. 960 screws a minute. My 204 iron ore in is being used. I would need eight smelters. So I can set up a manifold to dump all of my 240 iron into eight smelters in a row and then take all of that output, which will be 240 iron ingots a minute and dump it into 16 constructors to make iron rods, which will make 240 iron rods a minute. Then I dump it into 24 constructors. That's a heck of a lot of constructors. But it will make me 960 screws a minute, and this is the most efficient way I can make screws. I will use 100% of one um, ore node and make screws. So, let's say I uh, get an alternate recipe. I can search for, say, I have cast screws, which lets me turn iron ingots into screws directly without using rot. So, I uh, yes, search for it. And then click yes, and it checks, yes, I want this one. Cast screws. And it automatically adjusts the recipe to get me cast screws. So now I need eight smelters making iron ingots. And then 1920, 19.2, which means more than 19. So I need 20 constructors making 960 screws using the cast screw recipe. So there we go. So you can see how the cast screw recipe in this specific example makes things far more efficient. And uh, you can plan what you want to do. If I ever make that up to a Mark III, so I can go here, say, let's say I put it on a pure node and I have 480 input, I can change my input to be, oh no, now I've got 480 of them coming in. So I could make a whole lot more cast screws. So, um, it, it's very, very useful.